what up so we in my hometown benton harbor michigan we about to go to henry's hamburgers so yeah that's what they have hamburgers they got fries we going for a brown bag which the basic brown bag is a well i'm gonna tell you later in the video but hold on go ahead with your order can i get a um regular brown bag with a mountain dew no ice anything else no that's it 845. Thank you. Totally didn't know they had t-shirts. I'm gonna have to grab one next time. Represent. What up? Hey guys. I got me some Henry's. So I'm gonna eat it. <laughs> Henry's is in my hometown of Benton Harbor, Michigan. It come, if you get your brown bag, this is the brown bag. If you don't see that thing sweating like that, you don't see it sweating like that, that ain't right. There ain't no brown bag. Okay you know what I'm saying? And it's sweating because of the fries in there. You see it? The fries. You get a double cheeseburger. They do got a triple cheese too, but that's, I don't need all that. I don't need all that. Okay. So I'm just going to eat it. Now, we usually been harboring. So I'm going to turn that bag right down. It becomes a plate. So then, dump the fries out. One thing I will say about Henry's fries, though. One thing I will say about Henry's fries is they are not see. They don't put salt on them, but they give you salt and they give you ketchup. So once you break that thing down, just put the ketchup right on the tin up. I'm going to show you how I look when I get done. Right on the tin up. I don't even need no salt. I, as long as I got ketchup, I ain't never needed to put no salt on my fries. Ketchup on the fries. Mm -hmm. Once the ketchup on the fries, that's why I said once I got the ketchup on the fries, I don't need no salt. I don't need no salt. I don't need it. That's it. All right. The main attraction, though, is the burger. Look at that. Cheese. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I ain't had no Henry's brown bag in so long. But every time. Mm, I'm just in town. Visiting. You know. No major. We got a lot of places. I don't know how to not spill stuff on me. We got... For Ben Harbor to be so small, we actually got a lot of places that don't nobody else got. Henry's being one of them. You see them stripes? Or the green and white checker? You don't you know you at Henry's. Okay. We got Henry's. We got La Perla, Mexican. We got Good Fortune, Chinese. It's a few Mexican places here, actually. So maybe one day I might randomly just go to one and try it. But we got that. We got we got a this. We got a, a couple soul food places. Don't nobody got. Um. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got a lot. First of all, I used to be one of them people that didn't like nothing on their burger. Okay, I I didn't used to like nothing. I didn't used to like nothing on my burgers. Um, no onions. All I, I was a ketchup and mustard child. Like. Only ketchup and mustard. If it had tomatoes on it, I wasn't finna eat it. If it had onions on it, I wasn't about to eat it. Times have changed. Now, give me the works, fam. Give me the works. You feel me? Like, I need everything on my burger. It took me a minute. Because my taste buds just wasn't messing with it, you know? Taste buds just wasn't messing with it. Like, wasn't messing with onions and all that. But, I don't know, like... It took a minute and they adjusted. 
because they say like every what seven eight or seven or eight years your taste buds adjust or change or something. whatever either way it took me a minute i start i worked a full a few full jobs and i just had to start experimenting with it that's what i had to do because that's what i do you know i experiments that is my thing you feel me so i just started experimenting with like onions and peppers first but then i started experimenting with like then later i got into tomatoes because for a while i still wasn't messing with tomatoes but tomatoes completed they complete burgers everything that needs tomatoes on it it completes it you feel me it's crazy mm -hmm. it feel good being at home eating henry's Mm-hmm. 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 It's good. It's a good feeling. Drink wise, just red meat and it's a burger. I gotta get a pop to wash that down. But my other drink of choice when I come here is a strawberry shake. Or vanilla, but that strawberry hit different. And it's doing a lot. We're doing a burger and fries with a shake but you know what i don't care about that i don't care about that but um yeah then i'm so tempted because we right across henry's is right like kind of right by my favorite thrift store i should go up in though it's a gate if it was drivable i'll just drive right over there but you gotta go around because it's a gate around Henry's. Because I got some stuff to donate. This shit fire. I feel like you gotta splurge. Like, if you don't eat bad and you eat relatively good most of the time, when it's time to eat bad, splurge, fam. Splurge! Because you don't do this all the time. You've been doing good. This is your sign if you need it to go get you something unhealthy this weekend something that you don't normally eat you know if you eat unhealthy all the time i you know still spired fuck it for those that don't and you usually eat relatively healthy during the week like i strive to do because i meal prep during the week so that's it but it's hard for me because i since i like to cook i gotta try my shit who just cook and don't try their food you know i don't know but if you need your sign, here you go. Here you go. You see them? You see all them cars in the back? We got one right here. There's another one behind that one. They know about, if you know the vibes. If you know, you know. Mm -hmm. This is a nice little, nice little thing. All right, I'm done. All right, I'm done. Thanks for um kicking it with me, y'all. About to go make some stops and some runs and yeah. That's what I'm about to do. So see you later.